Thanks for joining us. You're watching Welcome Home, and I'm Rachel Stram with Simply Home. And right now, we're back in studio with Rachel Watson, owner of R and Co Bridal Beauty Team. Yay. Thank you for being You're here today. Welcome. I'm so excited. Tell me a little bit about what R and Co Bridal Beauty Team is. What you do because you don't just do weddings either. No, so we do weddings, and all our services are on location. So if it's a wedding, we're coming to you that day. You're not going to be stuck in a salon. You have full reign of wherever you choose. To hang out that whole day but we also specialize in boudoir and so we do a lot of all the events leading up to your wedding you're gonna have your boudoir photos you're gonna have your bridal portraits engagements all that so we want to be along with you through that, that whole ride you're a one-stop shop I am you mentioned boudoir yes it has become increasingly popular Huge. I hear and Huge. I see on Instagram and everywhere what what is it and what is the the massive appeal lately so I think for the longest time boudoir was very strictly people's mind went to Playboy and Hustler and all that and so like now we have boudoir which is just really feminine and soft and it's about like loving your body and it's it's great for the men too but it's also like something good for yourself so you're getting these like beautiful shots done that you would never think to just go get done and it's something special and intimate but it's nothing too nasty like <laughs> all those like it things. seems like part of your platform with it is really about empowerment empowering women that mm -hmm. was the word I was gonna use yeah I love that yeah we have some girls that come to us every single year to document their bodies and so it's just something just to watch the changes, but also they need that like, okay, it's been a rough year. I need another pick me up. I need to feel beautiful about myself. And they'll call us crying in the parking lot because they just got the email that, you know, they just got their photos back and they love the way they look. Yeah. And it's awesome. I, I would think that it's an extremely nerve wracking sort of thing. And I'd be nervous, you know, ahead of time. But I hear yeah. so many people say after the fact they feel so good and empowered but great about themselves. It's amazing like yeah. you'll sit with me and get your hair and makeup done and during that time is like kind of like your warm-up time you get your if you want champagne you get your champagne but it's just a very good like okay this is what I should expect and then you'll have Rachel come in other Rachel <laughs> you'll have her come in and she's just such an amazing photographer and so fluid with like her movements and calm and talks to you and doesn't talk at you the whole time and she'll demonstrate everything so there's nothing to be afraid of. Let's switch awesome. gears a little yes. bit and talk weddings. weddings. 2020 was not exactly <laughs> the year for, we know. <laughs> for weddings. Yeah, um, tell me about that. What have you seen? How has it changed? What's 2021 looking like? Uh, so 2021 um, is looking better. It's not, it's, there's still postponements. There's still all that. There's a lot of elopements or smaller, we call micro weddings, where they're getting married, but then they're going to do a big, wedding like your typical wedding later on but they, they still want to be married that's the whole point is not to just have a party but they're doing stuff now and then they're postponing but 2021's looking up 2020 was kind of rough was, that's good news was weird that's good news tell me because aside from just weddings and boudoir you are just fabulous at hair and makeup for all occasions so yeah. tell me real quickly because we're about to head into warm weather what are some yeah. of your favorite must-have products retinol and your skin is like your skin is your base so definitely I don't care if you're 20 get started on some retinol put it on slap that on at night like after you're done serums are gonna be your go-to but hydration is also like one thing that people don't think about like you know they want to have their drinks and all that stuff but make sure you're drinking so much water because I can tell if something's just dehydrated when I get to your skin okay. and so if you guys are just really feeling up your body with those things that you need, the nutrition and hydration, then you're gonna be good. One question that I had when I got married recently, I, oh, I do my makeup fine, I just wanna look like I look every day. Yes. I think that's probably a big thing that you hear. My best Huge. friend said, no, you need a makeup artist on your wedding day, and I'm so glad that I did. Yes. Um, how do you answer that question though? It's not your typical makeup, and you wouldn't want to pay that price to buy every single product. I'm sure people are great at their faces. They're great. Also, the stress that day is insane. Mm -hmm. So it's like you want to just sit back. I had a makeup artist for my wedding just because I know how those days go. I wanted to sit down, and I wanted to just relax and enjoy it. And also, like, you don't know if you're going to rush yourself that day. You don't know if you're going to have that day where you just can't get your mascara right or your mm -hmm. eyeliner right or anything like that. So put those to the wayside and just enjoy it and let the expert yes, handle it. Let us handle it. Rachel Watson, you're amazing at what you do. Thank, Thank you. you so much for being here today. Thank you Where for can people me. find you online or social media? Instagram, you can find me at R Co Bridal Beauty Team. My website's www.rcobridalbeauty.com and then Facebook R Co Bridal Beauty Team. 
Thank you so yeah. much. We'll link Thank to that you. from our website as well. Thank you. Well, don't go anywhere. When we come back, we'll be talking to a Nashville photographer who is sure to hype you up for spring. Stay tuned.